Hi, I'm Chris. And I'm Dan. We're two guys. One beer. Chris, we have two guests from the CFL, the Toronto Argonauts quarterbacks. Quarterbacks. Jess and Cody. Welcome, guys. Hey, thanks for having us. Yeah, thank you guys. We appreciate it. We are so happy you're here. In fact, I heard you guys had last names too, but I can't pronounce yours. <laughs> so I figured it'd be easier if I just called you Cody. No, uh-huh, that's worse, but it's Fajardo. Fajardo. <laughs> yeah, Fajardo. 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 Oh, there you go. Yeah, rolling yeah. R's over there. That's you're a, Scottish. That's the Scottish. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you have one of the real tough last names of yeah, uh, Matthews. Really tough one to get out. So Is, is that English? <laughs> I, I think it's and something like that. Yeah. I thought the best thing to do, since we had two quarterbacks here, is talk about beer. Yes. Love it. Sounds about right, yeah. You uh, you partake in the uh, drinking of? Two things quarterbacks love is beer and golf. <laughs> <laughs> and football. <laughs> I know you would hope so. <laughs> After work. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, I mean, yeah. We, I mean, we love I mean, we love, studying, uh, I mean, we love studying film and getting yeah, to know yeah, everyone and the offense. Yes. But. <laughs> so your boss got my call. Yeah. <laughs> he knows you're watching. Uh, Chris, we have uh, Sawdust City Brewing Company's beer here. Yes, I, I place this a place to stand it's a it's kind of the ontario slogan it's 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 to celebrate the the 150 years of canada being a country mm, nice. so uh they they designed this beer uh in collaboration with great lakes brewery they also went with a gastro pub on this one didn't yes, they it, it's interesting i don't actually know where the the, the griffin gastro pub is i i didn't look that up um but uh but you know, I guess it's a big collaboration for a, a big celebration. Now I'm thinking the name Ontario Pilsner. Yeah, that can't be all bad for two no. California boys. Sounds good. Yeah, sounds good. Showcases all that Ontario has to offer. There you go. You that see? interests me. It's kind of like our show. <laughs> <laughs> exactly, exactly. From everywhere. Let's give it a go, gents. Yeah. Okay. Grab a glass. Thank you. No judgment on the beer pouring. <laughs> no, there will be. There usually is, on my end. After you said that, it's all been concentrated. Oh, I spilled. It's all been concentrated. <laughs> yeah, I it's spilled. spilled. It's turned into, into a talk. competition. The pub. You like the pub, right? I love the pub. Yeah, you guys, it's, it's so nice in here. It's One wild. of these days, we need to actually grab some of these bottles. <laughs> yes, and try that. I know they're not beer. Yeah. <laughs> Do a little whiskey know. tasting every yeah. once in a while. Who's checking right. the inventory? Yeah. yeah. You saw that, didn't yeah. you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nice scotch little mix up there. <laughs> All right, let's give this Ontario Pilsner a go, gents. All righty. Cheers. Cheers. Thanks Cheers. for having us, Cheers. guys. Thank you Thanks guys. for coming. Well, that's a different Pilsner. It is different. Mm. Wow. I don't even know what to think of that one. It's not a bad thought yet. It's it is gonna, beer, though. It, so it's yeah, got, yeah, it's good. It's, no good. Bad it's good. already good. <laughs> I mean, there's only so many bad ones, and this is not it. <laughs> it's a Pilsner styled lager. Malt, hops, the, you know, the, the standards. You're the one that usually has the taste buds, Chris. Yeah, so I, I, what, what, I, what am I tasting that's. There's a little hoppiness in there. That's that's okay. a little hoppiness that's 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 what it the end, huh? Yeah. There definitely is some hoppy in there. Mm-hmm. I, I was going to say that. That's about all I have, really. I like it's it. Good. It's, it's, yeah, it's good. It's good. It's good. And it's not a strong one. Um, I did read on here because you know that's how we investigate. <laughs> we read the can. Yeah, we read the can. 5.0. Oh, yeah? Look at that. So, what's 5.0 um, alcohol per volume in US <laughs> translation? <laughs> We're just trying to get to know Celsius and <laughs> yeah. kilometers. Yeah, when you throw that upon us, yeah, now we're struggling. One. That's a tough one. Priorities. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he got the milliliters. I yeah. Won. So both of you guys are um, in the CFL, playing mm-hmm. for the Toronto Argonauts. Both of you are Americans. Mm. Um, what do you think? Of Ontario? We'll start of everything. There, <laughs> Gosh, I mean, this is my third year here, and I love it. I think there's always something to do in this city. It's just a matter of getting around and timing it. So you might have, yeah, there's something going on at 4 o'clock. you got to leave at 1 o'clock in yep. order to make it. You can't leave at 3.30. You're going to miss that show or whatever you're going to. So that's the, that's the hardest thing for me is, you know, there's just a ton of people. A lot of great people, but there's a ton of them. Yes. 
How about yourself, Jeff? It's been awesome. I was in Hamilton for a couple of years, so I was down I'm in there. Sorry. In <laughs> oh, <laughs> down in Lower Ontario, yeah, yeah, yeah. so I'm, I'm lucky to be in Toronto now. But I've seen seen almost all of Ontario now, so nice. it's been awesome. I mean, uh, you know, there's some great people in this league and some great people all over Canada, and we're blessed to, to have met a lot of them. And uh, now to meet you guys too, it's awesome. Nice. So we appreciate that's, it. That's right on. Now both quarterbacks, you guys know, and and uh, I'm hoping majority of the people that watch us over the last year or so know that we're we're huge Toronto FC fans mm -hmm. so that's how we relate because we still have to go to an Argos game and we're going oh mm -hmm. yeah we mm -hmm. are going yes in, in, in like uh, a couple days yeah we're going <laughs> yeah all right yeah and that's yeah. thanks to you Jen yeah of we course. appreciate that my question is you both play for the same team for the same position mm-hmm now the reason I brought up Toronto FC is, is that in comparison to like goalkeepers? Because there's only one. Yeah. And mm -hmm. you have to train constantly and be ready at any yeah. time. Yeah, for sure. What's the competition like? I mean, there's there's the two of you, <laughs> and then there's uh, Ricky Bay. That's the, the Hall man. of Famer. The man, yeah. The All Hall right. Of Famer. Yeah. Now. He's not a youngin' like you guys, is he? <laughs> no, he's dad. Yeah, he's dad. <laughs> <laughs> he's been around. He has, he's, he's, he's awesome. He's a great mentor, I think, to both of us. And, mm -hmm. and uh, you know, Cody's been with him a little bit longer, and he's been awesome to, to welcome kind of me to Toronto and to, to this team. And, uh, you know, he's just uh, a guy who understands so much about football. It's great to pick his brain every once in a while and, and to get some clues and, and some hints out there. And he's, he's a great dude also just to chat it up with. So Yeah. I think the quarterback position is one of the positions where the competition is going to happen, but all the guys are going to be close buddies. Jeff and I are roommates, okay. and last year I was roommates with another quarterback, so mm -hmm. every year I try and f seek out the other quarterback and be roommates. You just know what kind of guy you're going to get yep. each day, a uh, guy who's going to grind, a guy who's all about the team, and we understand it's professional football, right? So they're the best guys going to play, and our job right now as backup quarterbacks is to support Ricky and make sure that he feels comfortable with everything and we win football games. And, and this year already... Important. Mm -hmm. This year already, you have both been on the field mm -hmm. doing just that. Mm -hmm. um, how'd you guys do? Mm -hmm. I, I know you played, you, you replaced Ricky. Yeah, in, in Montreal, game. we're up in, in Montreal, Montreal a little bit. And, and Cody played in that game also. Mm -hmm. I mean, I think, you know, anytime we talk about it, we just, you know, we're always trying to put our, put our best foot forward to help our team win, you know, and that's what our position is, right? So that's what matters. Exactly. We're just trying to, trying to do whatever we can and however how we can do, you know, that to, to help the team win. So that's what, that's what's most important. So that's how we get judged, as it should be, and oh, uh, that's, that's how it should go. Everything's great as a quarterback when you're winning games. <laughs> Everything <laughs> falls apart as a quarterback yeah. when you're losing yeah. games. Yeah. So that's got, part of the so job sports, title. right? Yeah, exactly. Part of the job exactly. title. So it's good. Now, so win games, basically. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> we were talking earlier that uh, uh, Nemo Field, your guys' home stadium, hosted the great cup last year without you unfortunately and yes. ottawa was here yes mm. so what is it going to feel like for you guys to <laughs> yeah. win the great cup in, in ottawa i haven't even gone there but i like where you guys heads yeah. are yeah. Yeah. That they, is they great. came here, yeah. here wow. so we're, we're hoping we're hoping you guys statistically win. we should win it yeah. right yeah. Statistically. Yeah. So the math, is on the math adds up uh, <laughs> exactly <laughs> my uh, my daughter is going to school for physics oh wow and she mm. told me yeah, that's how. That's the math, that's the math right? Tell her thank you. Know? you. Tell her thank you from <laughs> us. <laughs> we appreciate that. Yeah, no, that would be great. I think Ottawa is a great city as well, and obviously a great football town. They've done a good job of turning it around there. Mm -hmm. Every game's almost been sold out. I think so. Yeah. And being close to Toronto, if we happen to be in the Grey Cup, which God willing, I hope we are. I hope so. Um, a lot of fans, I think, will tra make the trip and support us in, in yeah. that Grey Cup. Yeah, and also, uh, you know, obviously being in Ottawa in the 150th would be that's awesome. That's the big one. You know, that's, yeah. that's pretty cool. That would be, that's a special moment for, for this country. And should we feel like honorary Canadians because, you know, we get treated so well up here by yeah. you guys and, and we're really appreciative for that. So yeah. if, if we, you know, that's that's the goal, right? That's the goal every year to, to be playing in the last game. And if that would be that moment, that'd be a heck of a moment. Mm -hmm. Yes, it'd be great. Tell you what, you guys make it. We'll meet you in Ottawa. That sounds good. Sounds no, we got plans. Right. We got plans. That would right. be well, great. We'll meet you there. Uh, 
to be fair, we will buy the beer after, after the uh, yeah, that's right. celebratory yeah, beer. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, I mean, if we can get in. Yeah. Well, we'll figure yeah, it you know, out. I don't, I, I don't know what it would be like just knocking on the rock room door. Hello, you know yeah. who we are. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Drop beer. Yeah. <laughs> just bring these four cans. No, and no. I'll be like, all right, yeah. It's <laughs> <laughs> blue. Yeah, exactly. yeah, that's right. That's right. To be fair, we would bring enough for the team. Oh, shoot. Oh, they'd love that. They'd let you in right away. I, I already know who's supplying. <laughs> <laughs> you. <laughs> you, viewer, you. <laughs> no, got, we've, we've got a lot of uh, friendly uh, uh, breweries in, the, in yeah. this whole GTA. Yeah. You guys really, on your off days when you're not training or, or traveling for games, yeah. go out there. There is some, uh, some amazing craft breweries and gastropubs. Yeah. <laughs> so you you guys uh, you guys were saying that that one one big difference between the CFL and the NFL is is the time off between mm -hmm. uh, the off season. You, you guys have a bigger off season. That's what you're saying. Yeah, we got uh, six months <laughs> off, which is great. Um, obviously, it's hard to move your whole family up here. Mm -hmm. I have a girlfriend back home and a dog I just recently got, so it's kind of hard, you know, leaving them. But it's just too expensive to move them up here yeah. for six months and then move back for yeah. six months. So it's a great time you come up here you take care of business it's a professional job and you're working here yep exactly mm -hmm. and you get to go home and then you have six months off to relax rest your body and get to hang out with the family nice yeah very, very unique i think for you know uh for any sport or job you know to get that much time off is is a blessing and you know, i know we both try to take advantage of it whether it's going home and visiting family mm -hmm. and you know i got to spend a week with my grandparents you know and it was awesome last year you know i go see my sister she's out in seattle and some family in Montana, so I, I, uh, I get to travel a little bit and get to see some friends from college and everything. So it really is a blessing to have that time off, and then you know you start cranking it back up again. The season's right around the yeah. corner, and then and then it's it's uh, again awesome. Always a you know a blessing I, to come back to Canada. I think I could handle. I could handle that. <laughs> yeah, it wouldn't be the worst thing, huh? But I don't think I could handle some of the knocks you boys. <laughs> All right, because both of you. Are pretty daring you, you guys are runners yeah you know you're not just throwers <laughs> uh cody i hate to do this to you but i'm gonna okay because that's what i do now as everyone knows and we we kind of lied to cody and said we don't get personal I, hard hitting. <laughs> I, I told him that and he's throwing the question out like I, it's making me look like yeah. that guy yeah. i mean you mentioned your girlfriend and stuff and i don't like to get into relationships <laughs> but i'm gonna Okay. I know where this is going. I don't, so I'm nervous. <laughs> Your profile picture on Twitter with that beautiful blonde is, I'm going to put it up so you can see this blonde. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, hot. <laughs> two T's? Hot with two T's? Yeah. Is, is, that, is that a standard poodle? <laughs> oh, yeah. Um, my dog is uh, half and half. F1, half, okay. golden doodle. Half oh, golden doodle, oh, half yes. poodle. I, uh, when you guys arrived, uh, I was thinking about this earlier because we have a lot of Toronto FC fans who watch our show, and a few of them might just go, uh huh. Argos. You brought Argos on? <laughs> BMO Field is your home. Uh huh. Um, you're not going anywhere. Mm. Nope. So uh, here's my olive branch to you and the rest of your team. Mm. Um, and fans. And fans. <laughs> Don't dig up my field. <laughs> leave it pristine. If you think there's a play and that's the only play, but it's gonna leave a divot, no divot. <laughs> Just like golf, right? Right? You don't want the divot to come back to haunt right? you. Right, you know? Um, kudos to the grounds crew yeah. at BMO mm. Field because Bimo grounds, they, grounds crew. they do some amazing stuff because these guys are working hard doing their job. Toronto FC is working hard doing their job as well. And uh, welcome to the family is all I gotta thank say. You. Yeah, is you. you're here, so let's not bitch about it. Let's embrace it. Hope you guys win. You're from our city. You play for our city. You wear the wrong colors. <laughs> but we both got a little them. blue in our jersey. I, <laughs> I think still so. love them. Um, cheers and thanks for coming, guys. Yeah, thank you guys for having us. We appreciate it. This is a lot of fun, thank guys. You. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Uh -huh.